Hello everyone, Draken84 here and welcome back to another Shotgun King video. So, um, we are still on rank 3. Um, Richard III, I'm pretty sure that one is um, up next. Um, as always, for now, let's try to not kill a queen as our main plan. And if anything else comes up, we reserve the right to do something else. Wow. Yeah, that fire arc on this thing is huge. Um, go here, I guess, and then is there somewhere where we won't be in check from the night? I guess here. Yeah. Boom. We do have a giant range. That's kind of cool. Um. Power 3, this should be a 100% kill. Cool. And let's just go here and kill these two. We've done some damage to the king already. So. And... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the spread on this gun is so big. Alright, uh, Taunting Hop is extremely good. Once per turn you can jump over nearby piece for one damage without ending a turn. Very strong. Um, last Guardian, after killing a pawn, promote another pawn if it's the last one. That's um, manageable. <coughs> Corner Despot, plus one firepower, but only if your king is on the edge of the board. And full plate armor, all pieces minus one, minus one speed, all pieces plus one HP and blade minus one. Um, I still need an achievement with uh, full plate armor, but I think I also need at least one achievement with the Taunting Hop. So let's just go with that one. It's very strong and let's just not uh, try anything too uh, weird this time. Right. Um, let's try to go for the knight first. I think that's usually going to be sensible. Boom. Um, here I guess we are not going to be in check and go here I guess not entirely sure what the best course of action is here but we'll see uh, once I kill one of these pawns, the other one will promote, so that's something to keep in mind. Um, I should probably have traded in my Night Soul. Oh. There it is. And I, I'm going to go with the Rook over the Knight, I think. Mm. And this should be a 100% kill. Uh, go with the king go here boom ah the in uh, this gun is so inaccurate oh i'm 100% picking up the wand of downpour but, but let's go over all of our options i'm saying 100% but i need to check some things before that our presence non king pieces can't come near your king that's very powerful and it can honestly I think there's at least one achievement I still need with that. Militia add a pawn. Pawns can move and attack in four directions. That's um, usually manageable. Adding a pawn is usually not going to be a problem. One of downpour is very strong, but it does mean that it's going to be more difficult to not kill queens. Something to keep in mind, but we still need to three once achievements, so I think I'm forced to pick this up. And scouting, remove a knight, add two pawns, and pawns plus one speed. Something to keep... Um, um, tight leash on because you can definitely uh, lose to too many pieces getting promoted. I'm going to look for which achievements I still need. Yeah, just the ones that I um, was talking about. I'm gonna grab the one of downpour because I just really want the 3-1's achievement at some point and it's just very difficult to get. So I think it's reasonable to just go for it when you can. Right, let's Try and deal some damage to the bishop and go here, I guess. Wow, bishop is on the move. 
Let's just use our London down for it. And boom. Boom. I mean, we don't have any reason to stall here, right? I don't think so. Boom. Cool. Alright, now the queen is coming out. And there's Wand of Wings, so... I need at least one achievement with the Wand of Wings, but it's also a second wand for this one, so we're 100% picking that up. Gross Blessing, Fire Range is pretty good, but we already have a lot of Fire Range, so... I don't think it would be the pick even if, um, well, even if we didn't want the Wand of Wings. So yeah, Wand of Wings is great. I don't know if we'll manage to not kill any queens. We will see. Yeah, now we are in the way, so let's go here and just... Yeah, I really don't think there's a chance of us not killing any queens. Hmm. I don't know what the best course of action is here, but... Um, I'm gonna do this, I guess, and then this. Yeah, I just... I don't believe it was reasonable to expect to not kill a queen there. And there's another queen. Um, that's fine. Right, we still have the Wand of Wings if we need it. Don't know if we will, but... Well, there's always a chance. Boom. Yeah, let's just use that taunting hop as well as we can. Because it's pretty powerful. Oh, I completely forgot. I need the queen's soul. Boom, give me your soul. Boom. All right, that was fun. Um. King Shoulders, I don't think I need any achievements with that. And adding a queen is scary. I do think I need at least one achievement with the Cannon Fodder. Add a rook, gain two ammo each time you kill a rook. That's fine. Rooks aren't that scary at this difficulty. Um, I mean, they're legit, but... Alright, and King Shoulders can be extremely powerful. Right? You can just take out a queen by throwing it off the board, but I don't know. Yeah, there's an achievement for a guillotine, cannon fodder, and small fry harvest. Um, and none for king shoulders. I, I just don't want to deal with an extra queen right now. So let's go with this one. And hope that we don't accidentally uh, cripple ourselves with the cannon fodder. Um... I don't think there's a chance of me accidentally killing this bomb. Right? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, we're not in check, so let's just kill the queen while we still can. Do this. Um, do this? I don't know. It's probably fine. Let's just go for the king while we can. Um, it's probably a 100% kill, but I'm just not going to chance it here. Let's go here and do this and do this. Right, um, we have a very big fire arc and making it a 100% kill is just pretty good. Rightful curtsy, plus 50% chance to knock back an enemy, that's decent. Oh, there's Ritual Dagger. I think that's, that's what I need for one achievement that I don't have any other parts of. Um, but let's 
Finish this. Uh, add two pawns, add one rook. Minus two HP of rooks. That's uh, honestly, that makes rooks very manageable. Minus one fire range, we can definitely deal with that. Blade plus, plus one and king minus two HP. That doesn't really help us, but it's fine. And pillage, remove a rook, add five pawns, and pawns plus one HP. That makes pawns a little bit scary, but let's look at what our options are. Alright, I looked at the achievements, and there's one with Taunting Hop, Ritual Dagger, and Subtle Poison. So I need to pick this one up to try and get that achievement. Um, means that pawns are getting uh, pretty scary. So we need to keep that in mind. We're down a rook though, so that's fine. Wow. Um, right, let's try and actually deal with these while we still can. Alright, one of downpour. I think that's this is a good point to do that. Our um, spread is so huge that we can just, yeah, hitting anything is just difficult. <laughs> right, let's conserve some ammo, go here, do this, do this. Do this, oh we have one blade, that's kind of cool. Um, we're not going to be in check here, so that's fine. Boom. Um, boom. Well, we can't stop this bomb, probably. We'll see. No, we cannot stop that bomb. Uh, that's fine. Oh, wait, we can. <laughs> that's funny. Uh, that means that this one is going to promote, but well, that was always going to happen. Alright, pretty cool, pretty cool. Let's just try to kill some stuff. Boom. Just a rook left. Mm. Boom. Boom. Alright, yeah, we are in a good place now. We need more firepower. Black Mist is very, very good. Um, minus one fire range, we can definitely deal with that. Although, right, we did start with huge fire range and it's getting less and less. King's Mistress, add a queen. Queen's moves are limited to three squares. That's manageable. It means that queens are going to be a lot less scary, but there is going to be an extra queen. Rightful Curtsy, plus one max ammo, plus 50% chance to knock back an enemy. That's honestly fine with all of those um, pawns running around. And Trouble, plus four HP Rook, flip the card as there is no pawn on the board. Yeah, we're not doing that. Let's just go with the Black Mist. It's probably just the best black card, so... I think it's just always going to be correct to try and go for that. Um, this is fine. Hmm. Yeah. Always try and be sure not to accidentally kill yourself when at all possible. We are in check, but that's fine. Let's use the one of downpour first. Deal some chip damage to everything. Gain some tempo here. Try and kill this queen, I hope. Nope. That's fine. Um. I'm saying that's fine, but is it? Yeah, it still is, but... Hmm. We 
we can't really use taunting hop here. That's the, that's the biggest problem. Although we do have the want of wings if we really need to, so that's something to keep in mind. Um, a lot of pawns are promoting here. I don't know if there's anything I can do about it. Doesn't look like it. So I can jump over this rook to this spot. Yeah, I'm I'm in a pickle. I just don't have a lot of firepower. And I'm going to get overrun by all of the pieces that are going to be there from all these promoting pawns. And well, let's just get every action that we can. Um, go over here, I guess. That's a knight. Yeah. We are only in check from the queen, right? Cool. Yeah, everything is promoting and I don't think I can help that. Boom. There's a rook, there's a bishop, so we are this is yeah, this is very manageable. Honestly, this is just completely fine. Uh let's go here I guess. And we still haven't used our wand of wings. Or our black mist. Let's go here, I guess, and try and kill some stuff. We are not in check, so boom. Boom, boom, boom. Right, and boom. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, th there was no chance of not um, Killing any queens with this one. Remove two pawns at a rook, that's fine. Golden aging, make the queen and the king uh, weaker and every 10 turns they become slower. We really need more firepower, especially with the pillage, which added uh, plus one HP to uh, all of the pawns. Military academy is going to be um, a thing, <laughs> but we just need holy gunpowder here. I mean, I just don't think there's any way around it. I would love to remove the two pawns, but Golden Aging, while it's pretty decent, I think we just need firepower. This, we, we gave the enemy pieces too much HP, so we need a way to handle that. Um, yeah, fine. Um, go here and do this. Let's just use the one of downpour now. Uh huh. All right. Um. Go here. We need to try and actually kill some stuff here. Huh, that's interesting. They're not coming next to me. They could. There's no rule saying that they can't move next to me, but... Queens are scared. I guess. I mean, I am pretty scary, of course, but... It's kind of unusual. Um, I 
Yeah, this one is promoting and I guess that's fine. That one just promoted as well. And that one auto promoted. Because that's what the rules say. Um, Alright, let's deal some chip damage. Um, there's a lot of ways that I could try to handle this, but. I think we might be at the point that we just want to try and uh, use the taunting hop whenever we can. Right, we want space to move. Boom. Then go here. Use this. Do this. This. This, this. Alright, and we're at the point where we can easily just go for the king. Uh, boom. Probably we could have done that like two turns earlier. Oh, Royal Loafers. I think that's also part of, of an achievement. Conscription is horrible here. Let's look at the achievements. Yeah, I checked. There's an achievement for you. Royal Loafers and One of Wings and uh, Unfaithful Steed. So we, we would have two more picks to try and get the Unfaithful Steed, but I don't know. Conscription and Military Academy with just four firepower. We, we will just get overrun. How important is it for us to try and get the achievement? Because high focus is so much better. And Undead Armies is fine. Conscription does make it less likely for Less Guardian to trigger. And Royal Loafers is very good. I think I need to, to pick this up, but it, I really don't like skipping my high focus. That you might have, um, if, if you've been following this series, you probably know that it's a card that I pick a lot. Let's just use the one of downpour, I think. Check. Oh yeah, that's that's the the big downside to using Royal Lovers this way is that we end up with an empty magazine. Um, do this, I guess. Not in check, so kill some pawns. Uh, let's <laughs> not kill this one. Uh, the board is getting completely overrun. I mean, I could jump over here, but then I'm dead, so let's not do that. Go here, I guess. this, then this, then this, this, uh, this is a 100% kill, right? Yeah, it is. Boom. We are in check again, but that's fine. This pawn is promoting. Yeah, it's just going to be very difficult to actually get a good handle on everything that's um, 
going on on the board. Boom. Um. Again, I can jump over here, then I get an extra turn, but I... Then, then it's actually checkmate, because this pawn hasn't, will not have moved yet. Uh, that's, uh, that's a thing. If I shoot here, there's a chance for me to actually kill this pawn, so it's not impossible. But let's just do this, I guess. Um, this. Ooh, yes. That's probably kind of cool actually killed that one um yeah that one is promoting not much i can do about it at this point boom bunch just have too much too many hps do this do this do this do this this, 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 this. All right, yeah, we, we are getting a handle on this situation. And I think we can just kill the king from here. Oh, of course. Um... Boom. Conserving ammo. Not being in check. And kill. We, we have not had any need of the Wand of Wings. That's great. Alright, force feeding. Plus one max ammo. Don't really care about that with this gun. And you can put extra uh, shells in your shotgun above the normal amount. Zealots. Bishop plus one speed, bomb plus one speed, flip card if there's no bishop on the board. Bell traps, it slows down the military academy and the conscription, which is great. And ammunition depot adds a rook, but gives us more ammo. I am going to look if there's a zealous achievement, but no, it, there, there, there is, but it requires two other cards that deal with bishops. I need this one. Um... We have one more um, option to get the three, either of the three achievements that we have set up for, right? We have Taunting Hop and Ritual Dagger, we have Wand and Wand, and we have um, Royal Loafers and Taunting Hop, so there's a lot of ways that we might get achievements here. We have done our best to try and make it as likely as possible for us to actually do something here. Um, let's use the one of downpour here. Cool. Boom. Alright, the the we need, yeah, we, we need the, the the queens and the rooks to come out and play before we actually kill all of the pawns because at some point they're just going to be able to just straight up kill us. Um, do this, then do this, then stop this and go here I guess. Cool. Um, oh, now, now we are actually at the point where we have put ourselves in checkmate. All right, finally. I mean, for certain values of checkmate, of course. So I'm going to mark the rook and use the one of wings to jump over here. Cool. Um, we need to reload, that puts the rook there, the queen is going to be moving, wait, no, I need to kill this rook, 
Wow. That's a thing. Um, try it this way. Alright, that's a lot better. Do this. Alright, and then we can just kill the queen in the next turn. Maybe. <laughs> um, fine. Um, we're almost certainly killing this queen if we shoot here. It's not 100%, but... I mean, we could use Royal Lovers, but I don't think that's as good. And we have a backup plan of using our Black Mist. I think this is fine. Alright, well, don't know if it was fine, but at the very least it worked. Um, there's a chance that we kill this. I'm gonna try. Cool. All right. And then sort the king to death. Cool. Right, will we get an achievement this run? Nope. So there's high focus, uh, minus fire arc, which is great, plus firepower is great. Um, probably picking this one. Look at tower. Makes backup sooner, which is a problem with both of these. So <laughs> I don't think that's reasonable. Genderqueer. Uh, there's actually an achievement for King's Mistress and Genderqueer and um, the Secret Arrow. I don't think I have that one yet. And there's Extra Barrel. I mean, we're, we're picking High Focus and Look at Tower. And we came very close to getting an achievement this run. But, well, for a lot of achievements, it's just luck based if you get the option or not. Uh, I hope that. <laughs> Look at tower doesn't um, isn't too much of a problem with military academy and conscription. I just think that right um, high focus is just so incredibly strong that I I just I just think we need to pick it up. We are in check, which is fine. We are in double check. Right, let's go here. Actually use this one. I want to kill a queen, but I don't know how. Maybe that one? Not yet. All right, let's go here. Yeah, this queen is over here. We're not in check. That's great. Um. Oh, we can't actually move next to the queen. So we just shoot this queen then, I guess? Yeah, worst thing that can happen is that we do some damage to the pawns. Um, yeah, we had, we had a lot of time there. Cool. Let's go here. Alright, invite them over. This... And this should be a 100% kill, right? We have four firepower. Boom. Then boom. Then boom. That. Yeah, military academy and conscription with look at tower might be kind of problematic, but I think we should just be able to handle this without too much trouble. To 
this and try and kill the king. Yeah, cool. All right. Now we have a lot of firepower and we should just be able to mow through all of this to try and kill the king quickly. Because a lot of the time that's just good enough to... Uh, to deal with stuff. Alright, let's use the one of downpour. Here, this, um, we're not in check yet, still not in check, so let's, yeah, we, we have done a decent job of keeping high focus up, so, kill, cool, boom, Use this, yeah. Yeah, I focus with Royal Lovers is also just pretty good. Um, so, right, because you can just jump back and then uh, the high focus counts the, the point where you land, not the point where you started. Try this. Um, boom. And this. Boom. And that's a win. So I don't think we got any achievements here. We got so close to getting three achievements. But that's fine. Um, it was a fun run. We just got a lot of good stuff going. Um, we um, we did some different stuff, but, but we also just looked at what we needed to do in order to win the run. Um, at some points, we just needed more firepower to compensate for the cards that were already there. And we did that, so I, I think this was a very good run. Um, I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you on the next Shotgun King video. Goodbye.